Hello guys, welcome to a new tutorial. Today a simple tutorial about how to do a hand turn. Uh, if you want to follow along, uh, check my Gumroad in the description. The link to download the file of this rigged hand is for free this time. If you want to give me a donation for it to support the channel, please do. Also check uh, my other Gumroad files there. My rigs especially, they are very useful and you can use them to follow along the uh, rigging tutorial series on this channel okay so let's start here we are in pose mode this is a rigged hand we have bendy bones i have activated here b bones so you can see the bends in the bones we can use r to rotate and see how it works if we go to object mode and select our hand we can go to vertex or weight paint and check all the vertex groups here for the arms and the hand the hand we have two hands drawn let's go back to object mode the arm of course we have a hand two and we have another hand here so a back hand and a front hand <laughs> what we want to do is to turn the hand from back to front or from uh, front to back and also turn this arm so there's a simple trick we will use let's start so we select our armature again go to uh, pose mode control tab we want to turn this guy so it's i on the keyboard and then rotation and then i'm gonna go to frame 24 and rotate this bone with r i think i'm gonna rotate this one too so back to frame one and select this one i rotation to back to uh, frame 24 and rotate it just a little bit like this so we have this animation i think i'm gonna kind of loop it so we go to frame 48 we select these two bones and we select these frames here shift d to duplicate them to here so now we have this animation now we go here to frame uh, maybe here 12 and we want to rotate the hand it's really very simple we go back to uh, object mode first select this guy we hit insert keyframe and we do the same here insert keyframe and then in the next frame use the arrow keys on your keyboard frame 13 we will unhide this hand and hide the other one and other keyframes were created here as you can see so now we have our hand turn but for added beauty we won't just do it like this this sudden change we will go back to pause mode so control tab and select this bone we go to frame 12 where we made our first keyframe for the hand and we go back like three frames so one two three with the arrow key on the keyboard with this bone selected we check these axes here we can activate the axes here axes you can display them or hide them so we display them to see which axis is this one the horizontal the, the local axis of this bone and it is as you can see x so we want to resize this bone on its local x axis to do that you hit s on the keyboard and then you hit x and then x again you see when you hit x the first time you see this big line here this red line this is the global x okay so we hit x again and this changes the x from global to local so i hit escape i don't want to change the scale here i just want to add a keyframe so we hit i scale this time okay and now we go to frame to 12 here we do s x x and resize it like this okay it will give us an illusion of rotation the resizing of the hand and it's better to use uh, you can use the like rotate rotate and then you see the axis here it's y the local axis for rotation and you then you hit y to twice and now you can rotate the hand but you can see because of bendy bones everything rotates and also it's i don't know i don't like rotation in this case okay hit escape and now we will 
select this keyframe here and duplicate it just to frame 13 and then we go from frame 13 three other frames one two three and we select this keyframe shift d to duplicate it and here we are so now if we play our animation let's hide our uh, overlays <laughs> and so there is an illusion of the hand turning and not just flipping suddenly and now i want to finish the loop so we go here and select all my keyframes here copy them here or here if you want and this time we will just flip uh, these two keyframes so we go here we select these two with g we move them here and then we select again everything and with g we move them here and now we finish the loop let's change this to uh, 48 let's hit zero to have our camera view and you can see this is our head turn our <laughs> hand turn don't know why i say head every time so this was our tutorial as i said the file is in the description download it and follow along with the tutorial if you haven't done that already that's it now you can go to uh, rendering and you can render your animation by hitting ctrl f12 after of course doing some changes here in the output you want to do it as png or as ffmpg video so but that's another topic for another video if you want to know my settings for uh, exporting videos let me know in the comments thank you for watching and see you later in another video peace